Today we're going to be taking a look at Proton VPN and more specifically we're going to be having a look at the new Proton VPN browser extension and this works on both Chrome and Firefox based browsers. Now I've already made a video about Proton VPN before because I really do believe that it is the best free VPN that you can use these days and I'll leave a link to the article which also has the YouTube video embedded onto it in the description of this video here if you want to go ahead and check that out to get it installed on your computer but today's video is specifically going to be focused on the Proton VPN browser extension. Now before you download this I do recommend that you go ahead and click the first link in the video's description. It's going to take you to this page where you can get Proton on VPN free and it's going to allow you to sign up with a free account from this page. So you're going to click on get Proton VPN free and then if you want you can pay for this but we obviously want to use the free version so you'll just click on get Proton VPN free. It's going to load a new page and then you can create your account. So I'm just going to enter one of my email addresses here then I'm going to click on start using Proton VPN. It's creating our account. Proton VPN is automatically going to generate a password for you that's going to be secure. And you can continue with this password if you want. But for this video, I'm just going to create my own password. So if you don't want to use the default password, just go ahead and enter a new password here. Once that's done, just click on set new password. And then you'll be prompted to download Proton VPN. Now you'll only need to do this if you want to install the VPN onto your computer. And I basically show you how to do this in the other video I mentioned before, which you can also find on my website. But specifically for this video here, I'm going to close that. Then we're going to go to the Proton VPN browser extension page. And I'll also have links to both the Chrome browser extension as well as the Firefox browser extension in the article that I'm going to have on my website. And you can find a link to that in the description of this video. So once you've created your free account, just go ahead and click on add to Chrome, then click on add extension. Now you should see that it's been added as an extension. And depending on your browser, you're just going to have to go to the extensions and then manage your extensions and you should see Proton VPN here and it should be enabled. Just go ahead and click on details. And what I recommend you do here is pin it to the toolbar and that you also allow it to run in private windows or incognito tabs. To use it, you can basically just click on the Proton VPN icon up there and then you're going to need to sign in and then you're going to enter the details that you just used to create your free account. So I'm going to enter the email address and the password and then I'm also going to choose to stay signed in and then you should see this message that says you're signed in and you can open the browser extension to continue. So if we click on the browser extension now, right now I'm not connected to any server at the moment. So if I go ahead and click on connect, it's automatically going to connect to a free server that's available. So using the free version, you are going to have some limitations. You can't select any country and just connect to any server that you want. You'll have to upgrade if you want to do that. But just having a VPN enabled in your browser is already going to give you a little bit more privacy than you had before if you weren't using a VPN at all. And one of the best things about Proton VPN, if we go back here, is there's no data or speed limits. So you don't have a cap to how much data you can use. There's no ads and it also doesn't log any of your online activity. So I really like Proton VPN. This video isn't sponsored at all. This is just the VPN that I use on a daily basis and the fact that the browser extension is free makes it so much better now because it just makes it so much easier for us to protect our privacy while browsing the internet. So you do also have some other features here that you can select by clicking on this icon here. Some of these features are only going to be available when you upgrade to a paid plan. So you'll see it has this icon here and if I click on that I'll have to upgrade to get access to these features. So if you want these advanced features, you'll have to upgrade, but just for a basic VPN connection to a random server, using the method I explained in this video is already gonna help you just have a little bit more privacy while browsing the web. We can also do a search on Google for what's my IP, and I can already see that Google thinks I'm browsing from the Netherlands. And if we go to whatsmyip.com, we can see the IP location is detected as Netherlands, meaning the VPN is working properly. So usually if you wanted to change servers, you can just disconnect and then connect once again. And in some cases it might connect to a different server. But like I explained before in the free version, you won't be able to select any country that you want to connect to. You'll have to upgrade for that. And if you want to upgrade, you can go ahead and do that. 
you can see the prices here and obviously there's a lot of vpns available these days i just think proton vpn is one of the best they just had an audit recently and the audit found that they actually do adhere to the no logs policy and they do protect your browsing data so i really recommend that you check out proton vpn free if you're not using a vpn right now i highly recommend checking this out and adding this to your browser if you plan on checking it out let me know in the comments down below if this video was helpful at all give it a like and if you want to support this channel you can check out the youtube members section shout out to all my youtube members your support really helps out the channel and i'll talk to all of you guys soon